Hey guys, Rick Personas here, back with our video. So in this video, we're gonna remake the base from chest out business. But we're making it from scratch in Serum, so let's straight dive into it. So we're gonna make a base from scratch, sounding like this. So stack on a preset. First oscillator gonna be two octaves down. We'll be using this digital wave table. It's really gritty, so that will fit the style of the track. We're gonna slightly detune it, put the randomness down. Because it's baseline, we want it in mono. Then we're gonna shape oscillator B. It's gonna be saw wave, two octaves down. We're gonna we're gonna ephemerate it to just around here. So this sounds really bad right now, but we're gonna filter it. We'll be using the low 24 cutter front here. Quite some drive. Bit of fatness. And a little spike of resonance. Then we're gonna shape envelope one. Sustain gonna be down quite a bit. And just bump up the release. Then right to the cutoff. To around here. Stack mono to avoid overlapping notes. Also make sure to route us there into the filter. Shape it just some more. Then we're gonna route envelope three to the course pitch. So give it some more punch. Just a small amount I guess. Then the last thing we're gonna do is add a noise section. We'll be adding this rim sound. Pitch it up a little bit. Stack direct out. Just to give the sound some more punch. That's it for us later, so now we're gonna dive in effects. So first on distortion. We'll be using the direct one to really destroy the sound. We're gonna filter it. Afterwards, so don't worry about don't worry about uh, other frequencies clashing. Shape that filter like this. So that's why we got a really aggressive bass sound. Quite some drive. We're already getting kind of close, so. I'm gonna shape it some more, OT decompression, gain around here. Then I'm gonna add a phaser to it with the rate, depth, and frequency all the way down. So this way it acts like a like a guitar amp. So all the way up. Sound like this, we're gonna mix it in. Just a small amount. So without and with it it makes it sound a little bit thicker so it's quite a nice thing to add to your sounds then the last thing we're gonna add is the EQing just bump up the high frequencies a little bit sounding like this that's it for the preset so now let's check out how it sounds in the track together with all the other elements you have this kick drum These claps are coming from the Sounds of 2020 pack. It's linked down below. Then you have this Medusa kind of sound. So all together, it sounds like this. And that's it for the video, so if you like the video, please leave a like, and see more, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see y'all in the next videos.